We've made it to the first boardroom recap of the 2023-24 school year. Welcome to the August 21st regular monthly school board meeting. Let's get started. The meeting opened with recognizing Dr. Estella De Los Santos for serving 19 years as a VISD trustee, where she represented and supported all students, faculty, staff, administration, and the community of VISD. Thank you, Dr. De Los Santos, for your service. The regular school board meeting moved to public testimony, where citizens are given the opportunity to address the board of trustees. A public meeting was held to discuss the school district's budget, which will determine the tax rate to be adopted. Trustees and those in attendance were given a presentation by Chief Financial Officer Michelle Yates and Deputy Superintendent Randy Meyer. During a public meeting, community members are given the opportunity to ask questions regarding the budget and tax presentation. Just like students start fresh with a new school year, we are bringing you a revamped administration report presentation format. Let's check it out. Dr. Shepard opened the August admin report with items we are super proud of, like VISD being named TAEA District of Distinction for the fifth year in a row. VISD is in the top 1.3% of all visual art programs in Texas. That is so amazing. And we are proud of our 2023 Connect Conference that brought 165 new VISD teachers together for breakout sessions, intentional connection activities, and more. He talked about items you might be curious about, like attendance efforts on pages 16 through 18, and House Bill 114 and its impact on our schools and community on page 15. What are we working on? Well, that's easy. The budget has been top of mind and conversation and can be found on page 14. Lastly, Dr. Shepard shared what we are inspired by, the VISD Education Foundation. The Education Foundation has awarded over $63,000 to educators for the 2023-24 school year. They awarded over $16,000 in teacher toolbox gift cards during the Connect Conference so that new teachers could outfit their new classrooms. And for students, they partnered with Angel Lucy's Funeral Home to distribute over 600 pairs of shoes to VISD students for the new school year. We have to say a big thank you to the VISD Education Foundation for taking care of our staff and our students. We then moved on to action items where trustees discussed and took action on adoption of the 2023-24 budget. The board approved this item. Discussed and took action on adoption of the 2023-24 tax rate. The board approved this item. Discussed and took action to approve the fall board workshop schedule. The board approved this item. Discussed and took action to create a subcommittee to review teacher and staff compensation. The board approved this item. All items on the consent agenda were also approved. Following closed session, the board reconvened for an official action. And that's a wrap for the first board meeting of the new school year. Remember, if you can't make the VISD school board meetings in person, you can watch live via the VISD website. Visit visd.net and right under the rotating banner, you'll see school board meetings. Click that button and select watch live. And if you can't watch live, well, that's what we're here for. Make sure you're following Victoria ISD on Facebook, Instagram, LinkedIn, and subscribe to Victoria ISD on YouTube.